Welcome family and friends. Today I'm doing my third experiment with clothespin cookies. This is my third try making clothespin cookies. The filling is fine. It's the dough that I haven't liked. So I'm trying these puff pastries. pastries. <laughs> so I just wrote, uh, let them thaw. Cut them into strips and rolled them onto the dowel rod. I decided to try aluminum foil wrapped around the dowel rod instead of using olive oil spray mix. I'm going to see how this works. These I use the olive oil spray mix on. They look good. They look good all around. They didn't stick at this end, most of them. So I tried the next batch with pressing a little bit of water at the end to see if it would stick. We'll see when they come out of the oven. Vegetable oil did not glue the ends to the cookies. We'll see how they come off in a second. Okay. These in this first row here, I put aluminum foil around the dowel rod and they were harder to get off the rod than just using the spray, cooking spray. However, these couple here just fell apart. I had four that stayed together. So now I am trying aluminum foil with water on the ends again. This one I'm trying vegetable oil, like Crisco vegetable oil, on the rod and on the ends of the cookies. This one, I'm trying the aluminum foil with the vegetable oil on the ends of the cookies. We'll see what happens. I forgot to video the results. The verdict is that the puff pastries have the best taste of the three trials. Using foil is okay, but it's easier to get the cookies off the rod with just vegetable oil on the dowel. I haven't found a good way to consistently keep the ends pasted to the cookies. These are the best tasting cookies so far. Thanks for watching. See you next time.